A digital accelerometer is a device that detects the presence of a force or acceleration. For example, when at rest and connected to the earth, it detects 1g force. As soon as I accelerate it from being at rest, the accelerometer detects that acceleration by increasing the g-force, whether I accelerate it to the right, to the left, up or down, the accelerometer will always detect the acceleration 100% of the time. However, the instant I put the accelerometer into freefall, it detects a deceleration. It goes from 1g down to 0. If the accelerometer was accelerating down in freefall, it would detect that acceleration by increasing from 1g, not decreasing. Not only does the accelerometer show that there's no detectable acceleration in freefall, it also shows that the vector or force of the Earth is up. When I switch to the vector tab of the accelerometer, we can see when at rest on Earth, it detects that the vector or force is down, as shown by the green line. However, the vector on the phone is inverted because when I apply a force to the right, the vector goes to the left. And when I apply a force to the left, the vector goes to the right. When I apply a force down, the vector inverts up. And when I apply a force up, the downwards vector increases, showing that the vector on the phone is inverted from the true direction of the force or vector. So when the phone is at rest on the earth and knowing that the vector is inverted, the direction of the force or vector is up. Also, when the accelerometer is in freefall, the vector completely vanishes, showing that it's not being accelerated down by any force. Which proves that the force or vector of the Earth is up, not down.